Hi there, this is Roblox user CrazyMan32. This is the first of many videos in my tutorial series on how to build and program a Roblox plane from scratch. The goal of this tutorial series is to guide you through the basics of building and programming a Roblox plane that is able to take off, fly around, and land. The main idea is to develop a simple functional aircraft. Although simple, this tutorial may be difficult to understand if you do not have prior knowledge on Roblox building and scripting. In this first tutorial, I'll be covering the basics on how to build a physical plane properly. Building the plane is important because you need to be aware of the specific parts that you must have in order to have a functional plane. There are three main parts to a Roblox plane that must be included when building it. These three are the engine, pilot seat, and view. All of these are simply parts on the plane but are named specifically so that the scripts will later use them to help control the plane. So let's get building. So first things first, if you haven't opened uh, Roblox Studio, go ahead and do that now. And uh, just create a new place by clicking the new button in the top left on the toolbar. Uh, just get a nice blank place out. Go ahead and save that off as well. Uh, Nice to save your computer and everything. Uh, and I'm just going to kind of pretty it up a little bit. Create like a nice grass landscape. Make it pretty big. All right. Whoops. I'm zoom in all the way. All right, so first things we need to do uh, is get the required parts. So as I said earlier, the three main parts you need are the uh, the engine, the pilot seat, and the view. The engine will be used to hold uh, objects like the body velocity and body uh, gyro, which will help move the plane. The uh, main seat, or the pilot seat, will be used um, to identify when the pilot is in the plane. And that will just be a seat and the view will just be used to attach the camera to. So I'm just going to import a part here. I'm a big fan of using symmetric parts, so I'm going to set my form factor to symmetric for now. Uh, this plan is going to implement a uh, weld system as well, so go ahead and make sure the parts you use for this plan are anchored. And this is a nice thing about welding planes together, is that you can put the parts anywhere you want. Um, they can even intersect each other and everything. And the weld system will just uh, use whatever you have and weld it together. It's really nice. So I'm just going to create a pile right here. All right. So take a part, name it engine. And uh, the kind of nitpicky thing you have to make sure of here is that it's facing the right direction. Um, if you put it in the wrong direction, you'll have a plane that's flying backwards or sideways or something weird like that. Uh, to do this, uh, scroll down in the properties list of that engine part. And where it says surface, front surface, just change that to something noticeable like a hinge and this is the direction your plane should be facing and this is just temporary you can change it later um, so this will be your engine part the next thing we need is a seat so go ahead and put in a seat here um, I traditionally just like to make my seat red anchored and plate Seats as well have to be uh, facing the right direction. I'm pretty sure this one already is. Um, just to make sure, yep. And then go ahead and name that pilot seat. So this is the seat that the pilot will sit in and once the pilot sits in it, the scripts will take over and say, hey, there's a pilot here. And it'll give him the controller script and everything and get flying. But for now, we're just building. So now that I know that my pilot seat is in the front, I can go ahead and 
smooth that again. And the last uh, required part you have to have is the view part. Uh, so I'm going to name another part view. And again, it has to be facing the right direction. I'm pretty sure these are all the same direction. Yeah. Uh, this will be what the camera is attached to. So uh, I'm just going to put this right above the pilot seat. And it doesn't have to be touching any other parts or anything because the weld system will weld it wherever it is. So believe it or not, this is all that takes to make a Roblox plane. So right now I'm just going to group them together. I'm going to name this model functions just because these are the functional parts in the plane. And then I'm just going to quickly put together a little build to make it look more like a plane. So this doesn't have to be all too fancy, just uh, just want to make it resemble what a plane would look like as little as possible really, or as much as possible with a little amount of bricks. Oh, this is the worst when it's not correct. All right. All is well though, we can fix it. I'm also really big on making things as symmetric as possible, so <laughs> that's there too. And again, right now, I'm just kind of making it look more like a plane. This part of the process can uh, be all up to you. The sizing of the function parts also does not really matter. Um, just the direction of them does. And the naming. The whole build of the aircraft is totally up to you. Uh, you could completely not make any build to it if you really wanted to. That would be kind of pointless, though, wouldn't it? Oh gosh. Anyway, as you can see right now, I'm not using any like fancy tools or plugins or anything. Simply building the plane. Although I might have to use something here. Yeah. Um so if you want to intersect parts, for example, like I could do that and stuff, and the weld system would be totally okay with that, and it would work just fine. But right now I'm just going to move this little thing around. There we go. Finally. All right. Now we're talking. <laughs> okay, so I just about have my plane build here, um, and this is all I'm going to do for the first tutorial, just to introduce what the plane is and everything and how uh, it's set up. And one final thing, when you do make uh, your other new parts that are on the plane. Just uh, group those together and put in a model. I like to just call them parts because that's what they are. And then group parts and functions together and name that plane because this is your plane. So just a really quick recap and summary here. In a plane you have three main function parts. You have the pilot seat, the engine, and the view. Those are the three required parts on a Roblox plan in this tutorial.